How's it going guys? Welcome back to our Pokemon Ultra Sun series. In the last episode, we took on the Brooklet Hill uh, cha uh, trial and kind of had our team decimated. As you can see, we have a team recap. Only a couple Pokemon actually survived that. But maybe they've had been smarter. We do have a Fairy type and Dragon Rage would have done nothing because I'm pretty certain it's ineffective like Poison on Steel. But we've got Wings with Heatproof. We've got Tumble with Solar Power. Uh, tree with Wonder Skin, the Sorterra. Voltage the Flappy with um, Battery. Uh, Spiral of Serene Grace. And Fluff with Snow Warning. So I think if we'd have had this, we'd have might have not lost as many because it wouldn't have been able to use Dragon Rage. And we'd have had super effective with Fairy Wind. Unless Ice resists, I'm not, not really remember. I've gone to all around the same sort of level. We'll be heading to the Royal. Avenue, which means you can just follow this path all the way around. It does suck because we did we did lose our starter. We lost quite a few Pokemon to be fair actually. Gotta head this way. Oh the Cedar Order's blocking our path. They run off as there's two people in the distance. Oh, it's Zossi and Dulce. Is this a team recon fight? Hopefully not, but you never know. Oh, no, we're trying. I think we have to accept the battle. I don't think we can get around it. So let's just hope we're not we're gonna face something ridiculous. <laughs> He's got one Pokemon, can't be that tough surely. He's got a Skiddo. Oh the Go Go evolution. Oh but we're in the we're in the perfect Pokemon. When that we're, we're literally in the definition of the, uh, the perfect font. It's got trace, which means I can't use any fire moves against it. I think it's fire moves are resisted, or fire moves are like less damage. Uh, we'll go for gust. He's moves that raise the defenses, but we do solid, solid damage. We could use quick attack, but I always use a super potion that I... that's gonna raise to full. Can we get a crit? Because a crit will definitely win. <laughs> Asking you receive, you shall receive. We got ourselves a crit. Tumble through level 21. I don't think we have to fight both. We don't have to fight both. We only had to fight him. I must research the reason for my defeat. It's so pretty when your zero ink shines like that. See, so and then they then they leave. Are you No, she doesn't want to fight me. He does. He did. And then they'll turn around and walk back the other way. We can continue back this, uh, down this way until Route 6. Oh, there's an item. Always pick up the items. Ooh, bigger. I mean, that's a healing item. I think. I think it restores like 200 HP. I could run with it. Oh, that's an energy route. Oh, there's a mud Mudsdale? I don't know if I against Team Skull Grunts. Over here. I think she's got to try like relay on the game. I think that was like the last one she do. 
It's, yeah, Hapu. I'm pretty certain, uh, final, the final island you go to. Pretty certain. Is this double fight or is this... What, a 1v1? One v one or or one v one? One v one. He has a hunch crow. Um we should be fine to stay in his um his wings. Um yeah we have a high level in it. Uh we use Twister go for uh, Twister can flinch. Also that change that seems like a very pointless act because given I haven't used it in like soul sounds I don't think I don't think it can learn sounds like the soul sounds move. Bung attack does thirteen. We use twister again. Three twisters. Three hit KO. Four sixty, twelve twenty three. And tree get tree gains a level. Cotter Terra tree. It's got a giant tree on its back. Went very far. Oh. <laughs> they they run because of the threat of being crushed by a mudsail. Rescuing the Drifloon. Yeah, yeah. I am Johnny. New. Uh, Battle Royale, I think that's what we've got to do now, I think. Into, I think we've got to go, to go right into Royal Avenue. We've got Royal Avenue, Royal Avenue and then we've got the Volcano Park trial. But I'm pretty sure we've got to go this way. Got to go to Royal Avenue, which is about right up between us, how Gladian and Professor Kukui? I think? Maybe? I could right, be wrong. Not rem not really remember. There's a Machamp. We don't need to heal. We took a little bit of damage, but I'm pretty certain we were, we're healed into the battle right anyway. Really bad mistake, I'm wrong. Be interesting to see what the randomizer's got installed for as well. We enter Royal Avenue. There we go. Oh, we're, we're walking forward. As in, just like, uh, 1v1v1v1. I don't know if we can do this. As he just. The mask royal. Pretty soon it's Professor Kukri. The former of Battle Royale. Four trainers. Well, trying to pick three Pokemon. It's tough enough. We'll use any Pokemon. There we go. Yeah, first could be Gladian and Harry.
Let's just go straight. I'm assuming it picks um, our first three that are in our party. I assume so it'll be Rotom Tree, uh, Rot Rotom Dotara, and um, Pidgeot. Yeah. Just throw your electric types and just get targeted. Sent out an Absol, which is Steel Dark, or is it Steel Fairy? You send out a Floatzel. So nothing particularly too terrible. A double Floatzel. Badrass, that's now. Goes the bow. No, we don't get healed. Flux has trace, flux has tracing. Oh, flux has anger point. Okay. Absol also has. Tra How many Pokemon have got traces as a as randomized ability? Um, given there's two floats on the field, I think a smart switch for me. Oh wait, I, I only have one Pokemon. Oh, it's only one. Only a one v one v one v one. Um, where did you stab? Do that. I should take it. Try take it. I should probably should have gone for the float or. Because the float still has probably has like an ice move. No, you both use water sport. Oh great, Absol's using a Z move. What Z move could it be? Using Z power. Does it use like Z it's use Z Tom? Oh. Um Let's use Twister. Oh wait, I can use. Oh wait, I should use Twister anyway because Twister hits all three. Oh, quick back on the no float so. Oh, absolutely, we got we got the flinch. Um, and then we try and take out. We should we should we try and take out the absol. Oh, do we damage the float so? We'll damage your float sword. So instead of being a 3v3v3v3, quick attack damages by 7. Gust does some decent damage to. Oh, is this going to be a turn with the tigers? We should be able to take out at least one float sword. No, I'm going to get rid of uh, Gladian's float sword with this gust. There we go. Oh, that was a bite. Was that a crit? Hey. That's a 1v1. Another battle is over. Oh, that was fun. We took out two of the Pokemon. We took it. A Pokemon each sensor. Oh. Oh, yeah, well, you gotta come here because this is um like the person who's got the trout. Right? Yeah, QA. How did you even know? It's called. It's Professor Cuckoo. I'm glad you're glad you just walks off. I'm not here to play because you're weak.
just make sure let's just go and heal. So yeah, I thought we would bring heal going into it, but obviously apparently not. Oh well, we didn't lose anything. But it could it could could have been a lot worse, we could have lost Pokemon. But I think the advantage where we were slightly a little bit higher level than they were. Just gonna heal. I'll take your Pokemon for a few seconds. And that'll be of course where we enter this episode. So thank you for watching. Please enjoy like, subscribe, and until next time, see ya!